Hello, world. Today, you're going to write your first Python program. Open idle or start Python in terminal. Let's start with the traditional beginner's program. At the prompt, enter. Then hit return. Cool, right? Wrong. Totally boring. Regardless of what some robots will tell you, computers are totally dumb. You have to tell them what to think. So, let's try this. Ooh, my computer thinks I'm the best. Does yours? Why, thank you, computer. Flattery will get you everywhere. What happened here? I was getting such great praise. Let's look at that again. Do you see what's missing? We need to close our statement with quotation marks. Let's try it again. That's more like it. And of course it's your favorite language, computer. Now, you can use single or double quotes to enclose a statement. For example, and, but you can't mix quotation marks like this, or like this. Whichever quotation marks you choose, you must use the same kind. But you ask, what if I want to print quotation marks? Easy, you simply wrap your quoted statement in the other type of marks. For example, I wrap my print statement in single quotes to be able to output double quotes. I know, I heard you the first time, computer. You can also quote quotes like this. You just keep telling me that, computer. And that's it, kids. You learned how to use the print function in Python today. It should keep you entertained for about three minutes. So, when the excitement wears off, I'll see you in the next video.